with that said, I'm going to cover three uh, issues off the top, and then y'all can take it from there. Number one, I want to talk about our river. Mm -hmm. um, and I want to, I want to get, I'm going to explain why I think this is a problem the way the Democrats talk about it. It's a problem because we are by nature cerebral and intellectual. It's a problem because we are by nature willing to be curious and talk about details. We want to fully understand it. And so um, it's easy uh, when you start to learn about it <coughs> to realize that it's this multi-dimensional thing, and it is. It's, it's a problem with the way we uh, we're city planning on Orlando. It's a problem about what we're spreading on the agricultural land on the North Fork. It's a problem when you talk about um, cyanobacteria, and it's a problem when you talk about sewage, and it's a problem when you talk about uh, the reservoir and the C44 and what's built and what's not built and the CERP and all this stuff. But see, the, what, what's happening is our Republican brethren are, are taking advantage of these nuances to excuse themselves from an action. They're basically saying, this is so complicated, how could you possibly expect us to fix it? This is so detailed, there's so many moving parts, um, you know, it's just, it's going to take 20 years to sort it out, right? That we shouldn't, we should manage our expectations. It's going to take decades to undo what has been done. And so don't look to me for short-term answers, because there are no short-term answers. That's what they're saying. And I'm here to say, bull crap. Bull crap. Um, because, so I'm going to simplify the messaging for us who really actually care about this river. Because there is, the, the problem in the river is not the algae. The algae just brings it to our attention. The problem in the river is that we're putting water where it doesn't belong. And the reason we're putting water where it doesn't belong is because we can't put it where it does belong. And the reason we can't put it where it does belong is because somebody's <laughs> squatting on that land. <laughs> and they're squatting for their own financial benefit. The problem is greed. The symptom is algae. The problem is greed. The symptom is a destroyed ecology. The problem is greed. The symptom is bio waste on our land. But the problem is and has always been greed. That is the problem. There is only one solution to this problem, which is take that land. That is my messaging from here on out. We're about to take that land. We've negotiated. We've discussed. We've referendized. That's not a word, but you know what I mean. <laughs> we have taxed ourselves. Right? We've been patient. And I think it's time to stop playing the okie doke. Let me break it down for you this way. The White House is in Republican control. The Senate is in Republican control. The Congress is in Republican control. The, the gubernatorial house is in Republican control. And the state house is in Republican control. If ever there was a time where the TA team was in full control to fix this problem, it is right now. And if they're looking under the table and around the corner and down the block for a solution, it is because they don't want to look in the mirror. They have the power right now to take that land and fix this problem. They have not done it, and they will not do it because it's their BFF who's getting that money. That's why. If they wanted to take the land, they could. They don't want to. And so what they do is they send out people like Brian Mass parading around with a mason jar of green water. Dude, I know what color the water is. I live here. But when you're going to be busy calling me an angry black woman, I'm going to tell you, hell yes, I'm an angry black woman. Hell yes, I am. And here's an angry white man, and here's an angry young gentleman, and here's an angry white woman, and we are all angry. And guess what, Brian? We mad at you. We are mad at you. Because you let us down on this, the most important issue that you claim, the thing that you're working on with all of that political kabuki theater that you are perpetrating on all of us. We know who controls the purse strings of the federal government, your team. We know 
who controls the purse strings of the state of Florida, your team. So stop looking at everybody but you. The problem is you. The solution is me. No said about that. I'm going to talk about health care because it's really important that we understand this issue. 